hello everyone welcome back to my channel today i want to take a quick walk around of this 2021 ford ranger and this is a super cruel lariat trim level now this one is powered by a 2.3 liter eco boost engine that is paired with a 10 speed automatic transmission this new ranger has a length of 211 inches and a width of 78 inches a height of 72 inches and a wheelbase of 126 inches because this is the super crew cab the ranger is a mid-size pickup truck with a production that started in 1982 and ran till 2011 before it was stopped here in north america and it was returned to the north america market in 2019 after eight years this new ranger is developed from ford of australia ranger t6 and platform and the new Ford Ranger is currently being built at Ford's assembly plant in Wayne, Michigan. This Ford Ranger comes in two configurations right now, which is a four-door super cab with a six-foot bed and a four-door super crew five-foot bed. And this cactus gray is a super crew lariat with a five-foot bed. The Ranger is powered by a 2.3 liter EcoBoost turbocharged and 4 cylinder engine that is paired with a 10 speed select shift auto transmission. And this produces 270 horsepower and 310 pound feet of torque, which is the best uh, in class and torque. And with this powerful engine, you get 21 miles to a gallon in the city, you get 24 miles to a gallon on the highway, and 22 miles combined. And this Ranger can tow up to 7,500 and the payload of 1,860 pounds. This Ranger has a ground clearance of 8.4 inches for the rear wheel drive and 8.9 inches for the four wheel drive. And this comes with a Ford Terrain Management System. Are you still there? Please, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and share it with those who are thinking of buying a mid-size pickup truck so that it can reach more people. Thank you and enjoy the rest of the video. I am inside the Ranger now, and uh, even though this is a small pickup, it is very spacious and roomy inside. You will not believe how much uh, room you have. And uh, let me turn my camera around and show you. You have your push start button. Let me start it and show you what the interior is like. Yeah, I love the sound of the 2.3 liter EcoBoost engine. And uh, one thing that you are going to notice, uh, you have this uh, 80 inch uh, navigation uh, touch screen and you have uh, your hazard uh, button right here. You have a uh, different control and down here, have a heated seat in this uh, Ranger and here you have a 12 volt uh, charger and uh, you have another 12 volts there and down there you have uh, two USB and uh, down there you have uh, some other control for your uh, truck uh, your four low four high and two high and uh, this is what your gear lever is like uh, I love how it feels it feels really nice and now uh, this has a leather interior and there you have a ranger boldly written more control you have all your different uh, light control and uh, you have your vent there one really cool feature with this uh, ranger is that you have a, a power folding mirror so you push on that button your mirrors uh, will fold, which I think it's really nice, uh, especially if you are parked in a place that is uh, tight. And uh, you can also use that same button to actually uh, unfold your mirrors, which really helps. So if you're parked in a tight uh, space. And on the steering, you have your different uh, control. And uh, over here, you have... Uh, cruise control uh, setting and there you have two uh, four uh, inch uh, digital display here you have your fear level uh, which says uh, currently 40 miles to empty and you have 24.4 uh, miles on this uh, 
Ranger. And I love how bright the digital display uh, cluster is like. I think uh, Ford did an amazing job uh, in building this uh, truck. It looks compact from outside, but very spacious. There you have a B&O uh, sound system. Almost all the Ford right now comes with B&O uh, sound system. And here you have a eight way power driver seat and uh, you have a six way power uh, passenger front seat. In the rear you have, uh, there you have two USB charger and you also have an AC uh, 12 volt uh, charger. There you have uh, two cup holders and if you don't need the cup holders, you can just uh, pull them away. And here you have uh, a manual uh, window release so you can actually manually open that and you also have uh you can open that uh electronically there is a cord right there or maybe not for a small pickup like this i think it's very spacious and roomy and i think uh, ford did a great job in designing this uh pickup so what do you th now when you approach uh this 2021 uh, Ranger Lariat and the, like I said this is the Super Crew the first thing that you are going to notice is this uh, Hankook uh, Dyna Pro ATM uh, 18 inch uh, wheel and tires you have this beautiful alloy wheel with the Ford logo uh, in the middle and here you have uh, your running board and uh, your key code if you want to uh, like use that to get in your car which I think uh, or your pickup which I think is uh, really cool. Now, this one is the FX4 uh, off-road. This doesn't have any uh, sprays in a bed liner, which I think it's okay. And uh, to open the tailgate, you have uh, to put it up, you use that same. Uh, and down here, you have a uh, hook, pretty good. And you look at the front, you have uh, two hooks. And here you have uh, your fog lights and down there you have sensors. And in the front you have a uh, Ranger boldly written with the Ford uh, logo in the middle. This is what the interior is like and uh, when you approach you are gonna first notice the beautiful well put together this uh, Ford Ranger is. And if you are wondering how much this uh, Ranger cost, uh, this cost about $46,495, uh, uh, which I think for a truck pickup like this, I think it's not uh, bad. And uh, let me take you inside and show you more about this uh, the Ranger. Now, I mean, think about this 2021 uh, Ford uh, Ranger with the cactus uh, gray and ebony uh, interior. Please, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, like this video and press the post notification icon. And I wanna say a big thank you to Ford of Kirkland for giving me the opportunity to come in today and film some of the amazing pickups and trucks that they have. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time.